Today, we are going to be playing one of the best new upcoming combat games on Roblox. 2023 seems to be a promising year for games on Roblox as so many new games are set to be released. But today, we're going to be playing and focusing on one of these new upcoming combat games that seems to have a lot of potential. Damn, here's my old Roblox character just dead. And here's a new animated one. Uh, but yeah, let me go ahead and show you guys all the weapons in this game because this game is a pretty nice combat game. So look, we got Cold Steel. Um, there's actually abilities in this game, so you could actually have like alts and super moves. We got the flame collar, and um, each and every one of these weapons have their own like unique super moves that you guys could go ahead and use. Um, this one right here is actually one of my favorites. It's literally Zoro Sword. We got the hundred fold slash. Um, so yeah, like these are all based off of animes. This one's the scythe. I'm not sure which one that is. We got the ember staff, and last but not least, we got the dragon slayer, bro. And this thing is clean, and it does have a super move as well. So yeah, we're gonna go ahead and hop into this game and just test out the combat and just give an honest showcase. First kill of the video? Okay, there you go. Um, but yeah, this is kind of like a battle arena type of game. And uh, I'm not gonna lie, the, the controls are actually very nice. They're pretty similar to Combat Warriors. Um, so we got the sliding, we have dashes, we got parrying, and all those like cool combat features. But the one thing that catches my eye though is, the, is like the super moves on this. Like you have like ultimate moves. So like the more damage you get, as you guys can see on the left bottom side of my screen, you have that little like super bar. So every time you hit somebody, that super bar charges up. Um, so yeah, it's pretty cool, man. You have like little perks as well. You could have like you could pick up health potions and like get a bunch of like relics, I guess. Um, so it's pretty cool so far. I, I really like this. It's time to use a dragon. Okay, why am I bald as hell? Alright, so this is my first time ever playing like one of these like next gen Roblox games where it's like animated avatars instead of like the OG like Lego. And, I mean, so far I actually really like this, bro. Like it gives it's it's like super futuristic, bro. Like. This is, this is, it doesn't feel like I'm playing Roblox right now. This does not feel like Roblox. Like, this is crazy, man. I, I like this a lot. Um, so yeah, we're using the Dragon Slayer right now. And we, we're just going around the map and just like going on a kill streak, man. Like I said, this is a battle arena type of game. So you gotta like make sure you're always killing people. Try to get a big kill streak as possible. There we go, bro. We just killed that guy. Yo, the Dragon Slayer is broken, dude. 62 damage per M1. That's really good, bro. Um, but one thing about it is it has like a super slow like like attack speed Ooh, we got that guy with the parry bruh uh, but yeah as you guys can see i'm just like switching around my weapons i'm just trying to get like a good glance of all the weapons they have in this game because like i said bro this game is like it has like the same game mechanics as combat warriors but obviously this is like a battle arena type of game and you have super moves which is actually okay hold on it's kind of bothering me now why is my character like bald as hell on the back bruh uh, but yeah, as you guys can see, it's a, it's, a, it's a decent game in terms of combat. I actually really like the combat. Like, it's not every day where you see these type of... Okay, yo, hold on. Why am I getting... Yo, yo, chill, bro. This guy's sweating. There we go. Yo, that was that was a last-minute clutch, bro. I had, like, zero health. <laughs> no way. He said no way, bro. I'm, I'm surprised. All right, we got two people with our alt right here. There we go. Now we just go in for the kills. Parry this guy. There we go, bro. That's what I'm talking about. We're st I'm starting to get the hang of this, man. I'm starting to get the hang of the combat and, like, the mechanics and stuff. I'm telling you guys, it's, it's like similar to, to Combat Warriors. Okay, this guy right here is panic parrying. That's that's your first mistake, buddy. You panic parry? Bro, why are you guys panic parrying, man? See, that's, this is what I mean. Like, it's the same thing that happens in Combat Warriors, bro. Like, the saying, history repeats itself. It's true, bro. Like, people panic parry in every single game. Like, as soon as you go up to them, you just stand still and they just parry. Like, okay, he got... Okay, 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 okay. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. There we go, man. Um, but yeah, like, like I was saying, guys, like, people panic parry all the time. You just go up to them, stand still, and they're just gonna parry because they think you're gonna attack them. And then once they do that, you just go in and just, like, straight up destroy them, bro. There we go, man. Yo, the Dragon Slayer is broken. Or it's called the Siege Breaker in this game, but obviously, it's the Dragon Slayer from the anime Berserk. Pretty good weapon, man. 62 damage per M1. That's crazy, dude. We got that guy with the parry. And there we go, man. I'm starting to get the flow, bro. I'm starting to get the flow of the game. And once you get the pump, you just keep going, man. Look, this guy panic parried as well. And we just go in and finish him off. He's running. He's running. And there we go, man. GG's, bro. Um, so, yeah. We literally just wiped out a bunch of people. Let's keep going. Another cool thing with this game is uh, every weapon that you choose, you could get perks with it. Like, for example, like, there's different perks you could go for. Um, so, like, some of them, for example, like, I'm just trying to think from the top of my head. It's like... Um, you recharge stamina faster. One of them was like you should run faster. You could double jump. You, you could jump higher. So you could really like mess around with all the perks and just like make your character the best build as possible. Oh my god, bro! I yo, I've parried. What? Ain't no way, bro. Hold on, hold on. Revive, 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 revive. Come on, come on, come on. Okay. All right. This guy's running at me. Okay. Hold on. Let me parry him. 
There we go. Okay, I don't know why, but that was kind of delayed, though. Why was that parry, like, 10 seconds, bro? That's the one thing that I kind of don't like with this game is the fact that the parry lasts a little too long. Like, I parried, and it lasted, like, 3 seconds, and the guy swung at the last second, and he got parried. So that's one thing that maybe not the best about this game, but I, I think they might fix it, because this game is in, like, early testing right now. Obviously, it's still being made. It's still, like, lots of room for improvement, but... Overall, I feel like the game is pretty good. There are some things that need to be fixed, though, like the parrying and stuff like that. But, yo, overall, I really like this game a lot, man. It's a really good combat game. Um, it has a lot of potential, bro. Don't get me wrong, man. This game has so much potential. It's an early testing right now, and it's going to be coming out pretty soon, bro. I'm going to have the link to the game in the description down below when you guys want to play it. But, bro, trust me, it's a good game, man. I really like the mechanics, man. All right, let's go ahead and push these guys right here. There we... Oh, okay. We we just died instantly. Okay. Alright, so we got some people over here. There we go. We got him with the parry. Alright, so one more person just charged up on me. Okay, hold on. Watch this. And there we go, bro. The super moves on this game is so cool, man. There we go. We just hit him with that full dash. Look at my movement. Look at this movement. Look at this movement. Look at that, bro. That's so clean. Oh, uh, yeah. You could really move around in this game. I really like the movement mechanics. That's, that's, that's a really good thing about the game. There we go. Oh my days, bro. I'm telling you, bro. The super moves on this game are so broken. Hold on, hold on, hold on. We, 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 do, we don't die here, boys. We don't... Wait. No way. Come on, come on. Bro, there's no way I died to this guy. Come on, Floaty. There we go. Okay, he's down. He's down. Get the kill. Get the kill. Come on, come on, come on, bro. There we go, bro. I'm telling you, bro. Okay. All right. There but yeah, there you guys have it. This is probably one of the best, like, upcoming combat games I've seen on Roblox so far. Um, yeah, one of the big factors is because it literally is next-gen, bro. It's not every day where you see these type of Roblox games where it's, like, next-gen games and it includes combat. I feel like a lot of games that are, are on Roblox that includes, like, these next-gen avatars, they're not really combat games. Like, they're probably, like, role-playing games and stuff like that. So, this is a combat game, which is probably one of the main reasons why I like this a lot. You don't see this every day, man. I don't know how many times I said that, but it's true, bro. You don't really see these type of games every day, which is why, like, it's, it's nice to see, man. Um, but yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'm going to have the link to this game in the description down below, along with their Discord server. If you guys like this, go ahead and check it out. It's a pretty good game, and I'll see you guys all in the next video.